Welcome back to Living Local. Going to prom is a special and exciting time for teens, but the cost of a prom gown may keep some girls from attending. That's why the Davenport Public Library started its prom dress drive and giveaway to help local girls say yes to the dress. Joining us in studio today is Brittany Peacock. We got the BPs in the house today. Yeah. Brittany Peacock, Brittany Price. Great to have you here <laughs> in studio, Brittany. So how long has the Davenport Public Library been doing this prom dress drive and giveaway? Yeah, so we started this last year uh, and we had great success last year. We brought in 300 uh, dresses and so we thought, let's do it again. This was such a success. So we've been planning for months mm -hmm. and have been collecting the last month or so and so we're excited. This is a, such a great resource that the library offers local teens in our area. So how many dresses were donated last year and how many did you give away? Yeah, so we had over 300 mm -hmm. donated and we had 90 uh, students show up and 50 went to new homes. Oh, so that is fantastic. Great. Yeah. Wow, so great success last year. So for the dresses that did not get given away, what happened to them? So they were donated to local organizations to help um, our youth in the area. So um, one of the organizations was Night to Shine. Um, got quite a few, so we're excited to do that with what's ever left over this year too. Wow, 300 dresses donated, so huge thanks to the community for yes. stepping up yeah, and donating. Do them. That's wonderful. So um, how are you expanding the event this year? Yes, so we had a lot of questions last year. What about menswear? Mm. And we thought, oh my gosh, we want to start small. We don't know what, we right. don't know what this is going to be. Mm. And uh, since it was so successful, we thought, well, let's include these guys, mm. the fellas. So um, we were excited. We're going to start accepting blazers, um, suits, tuxes, ties bow ties. Yes, because it gets expensive for the guys yes, too, you know. Absolutely. So now I understand that the donation deadline has actually passed. So are you still accepting donations? If people are watching this, how can they get involved? Yes, bring us your stuff. <laughs> Clean out those closets. Some of these items mm -hmm. from my closet, I bought them and I no longer can fit them. Mm -hmm. There's no way I'm ever going to wear these again. So if you have those beautiful dresses, those suits that you don't wear anymore, bring them on down. Um, we'll accept them. Um, the Fairmont Library would be the best place to drop them off, but we can get them to, to the Fairmont Library. And I know a lot of people out there have been in a lot of weddings. They may have yes. bridesmaids dresses. Those work great yes. as formal wear or Absolutely. prom dresses. So um, when and where will the formal formal wear giveaway be happening? Yes, so it's going to be on this Friday, or um, excuse me, this Saturday, mm -hmm. the 18th, at our Fairmont branch, 6000 Fairmont Street, uh, from 2 to 5. And if you come... Early, we're also going to do a little fashion show as well with um, some of our teens. That's so awesome. Be very fun. So, Brittany, last year when you guys gave away these dresses, what was the reaction of the girls that received them? So much excitement. Mm -hmm. This this is such a burden taken off of many families' shoulders. I mean, I remember going to prom and four hundred dollars was oh. was what you spent on a dress. Right. And, I remember the same. And I spent I saved up that money all year round and I somehow was able to come up with it. And mm -hmm. it's such a burden and the fact that they could get a brand new dress. I mean, we only wear our dresses once. I know. And so they're basically brand new. So this is such a great a great thing we can do for our community. It really is. Now why is this so important to the Davenport Public Library to continue it for a second year yes. and hopefully for many more yes. years to come. Yeah, so we kind of want to eliminate the stigma that we're just books. Mm -hmm. We love our books, we love literacy, that's what we're here for, but we're so much more. Um, and so our community supports us so much that we wanted to expand our services and show them that we can also provide these really cool programs and free stuff. Mm -hmm. Now, what ladies are eligible and guys to, yes. to receive these free pieces on Saturday? Yeah, so all area teens are welcome to show up and then those that are planning on attending the Tim Tebow Night to Shine are welcome as well. Awesome. Want to definitely get on that if you are eligible. Yeah. Um, so in addition to the formal wear giveaway, the Davenport Library is also hosting a winter reading program. Yes. So while you're here today, Brittany, we'd love to know more about that. Yes, thank you so much. So that also starts on Saturday. Mm -hmm. So easy, easy things to remember. Um, that can You can pick up um, your forms at any of the Davenport Public Libraries. This year is a little different. We're not doing reading logs. Um, so any program you attend, so if you're there to get a free dress, fill out a slip. Um, every book you fill out, you get entered in for a grand prize. We have a weighted blanket and Kindle for adults and um, a burrito blanket and a year subscription to Disney Plus for Oh the my kids. gosh. So it's pretty awesome. Amazing prizes. I want to yes. get that burrito blanket. Uh, That's yes. where it's, it's at. It's very cute. <laughs>
<laughs> if you don't know what it is, Google it. Yeah, that's amazing. I just saw it recently, actually. It's hilarious. <laughs> yes. Well, Brittany, thank you so much for being here. Yes, we appreciate for it. Me. All right, if you would like some more information, you call 563 326 7832. We will also have these details posted on ourquadfittings.com.